11 reasons. 11 reasons you need to start a YouTube business as an African today. And this is so super exciting because I have been on YouTube, you know, cumulatively for about five years, but more seriously for about less than two years. And I can tell you for a fact that my life have moved in a totally different direction in just less than two years. And that's why I feel that you have to think about the YouTube strategy for whatever business skill or personality that you're currently building because you will see the return on investment and you'll be happy. Trust me on this, okay? YouTube has a whole lot of potential that is rolling out so much more in the coming year that I can't I can't not tell you about it. No, I'm not that selfish. So I'm going to give you 11 reasons why you need to jump on the YouTube train right now and begin to carve your niche right here. Number one reason why I think you need a YouTube business is it helps you build your personal brand. Now, that's like a cliche. What does it mean? It makes you to begin to own a platform where you are king, where it is all about you and your ideals and your values and be able to attract your kind in a little amount of time so you can give value and earn from the value that you bring as a person personal branding youtube helps you create that faster because people can relate to you when you're watching them than when you read what they wrote right that's why i think that youtube is a great platform for you to build your personal brand number two reason why i think you should be on youtube is that you make impact you will see people thanking you, oh my god, thank you for this video, it helped me. Because you can't tell, you can't even tell where people are watching you from and how that, that thing you think is normal, you are just sharing your life, your knowledge, your expertise, Some it might be a lifeline for another person. You don't want to stay without making an impact. You are not made to be less, you are made to be more. So take the advantage using YouTube, right? Number three reason why I think you should be on YouTube really fast is that it helps you to express your creativity. Ah, the video editing skill I'm learning now is busted my brain. Like, it helps you express yourself, express your creativity, where you want things to be, how you want it to be, how you want your content to sound, how you want it. I mean, YouTube just gives me the high. And I know it will do for you as well, if you think about it. Yeah, the first reason why I think you just have to be on YouTube, you just have to be on YouTube, is that it makes you less selfish. You won't just be there consuming, consuming, watching what other people are doing. You're a star, you're an original. God made you to be a creator like Himself. We are co creators with God. So, why would you just be there wasting your experiences, not putting a camera on what it, what is happening around you, not putting a, a camera on what you know so they can benefit other people? You have to move from consumer to producer or creator, you know, and it makes me remember uh, one of our Nigerian candidates in the upcoming election says he wants to take us from consumption to a production country. <laughs> All right. <clears throat> Pardon me. So, yes, it helps you to leave that lane of just consuming, looking at other people and feeling bad and feeling down and getting inspired and not doing anything and feeling less to where you become a god in your space. Yeah, you're a creator. Another reason why you must be on YouTube, and I think you should start this time around, is that you build a portfolio. So when somebody says, oh, what do you do? How can we access your services? Your YouTube channel is a go-to place for them to easily verify on the spot and see how they can work with you, right? So there's no reason you should be waiting. It gives you, you know, if anybody can write anything, but when people watch you, and hear what you do, your offers, your businesses, your, you know, the knowledge you decide to share, it's easy for them to take a decision to work with you. So you build a portfolio out of what you do using your YouTube videos, right? So you see that the last time you should have joined was yesterday and the right time is now. <laughs> so please, the next reason why you need to join YouTube is that you, you deserve to be seen, be heard and be known. You shouldn't die in obscurity bring yourself out there bring yourself out there youtube gives you a fantastic platform no hiding behind any platform and anything you come out face forward and build yourself share yourself share your skills your business your lifestyle right and then attract your kind attract your kind 
You deserve to be seen, you deserve to be heard and learned from, and you deserve to be known. You can build a name that people can recognize from afar. Oh, yeah, I know him. I know her. I watch his videos. He has helped me so much. That's the kind of family, even your family legacy that you should build. A notable name. A notable name. You see how Wikipedia is? You can't be on Wikipedia if you're not notable. Yeah. Be seen, be heard, be known. And that is why I think you have to be on YouTube really fast. It's, you build a community of like mind. You build a tribe. People who can go out there for you all across the globe because they buy into your ideology, your values, and who you are. There's no reason. There's no reason why you should, you should keep delaying and keep saying, giving excuses. People are on this platform who are doing nine to five jobs, who are doing tasking businesses, who are stay at home mom, who have to grapple with a lot, but they are still putting in the work right here. Okay? So don't let it stop you. Don't let anything stop you. When you start your YouTube channel as well, you are going to be empowering your continent. You're going to bring out the essence of your community, your town, your city, your country, your continent. Because it's possible for people to be on this space. I have never found anybody like you. I have never found anybody from your part of the world. Just because, you know, they are not in that space or people, or people who are from your region are very few on this platform. People want to know you. So you can use YouTube to empower people. I know Odetta. I just started following her recently. That woman inspired the shit out of me. She started her YouTube channel and she worked out an empowerment platform out of it where she uses her YouTube earnings to be able to give grants to people who watch her videos. That, did you hear me? You can empower your continent. You can empower your country. You can empower your family using YouTube. Yes, because this platform right here, you can create content elsewhere in other places who are also paying but youtube is a formidable place to empower people because you are empowered yourself okay the next reason of course is that you're going to make money nobody's selling it enough you're going to make money you're going to make money on, on youtube you're going to make money from things you do people who are watching you you're going to make money from the platform itself oh my gosh and Whatever video you make is like real estate, it's gonna keep appreciating. People are gonna keep watching it, stumbling on it. 10 years after the, down the line, you're still making money from me. So what are you waiting for? Tell me, what are you waiting for? I don't know whether I've given you 11 points already, but see, let's talk about this. What are the hindrances to starting a YouTube channel? What are the things that are going on in your mind right now that make you feel like, mm, I love this thing you're saying, Chi, but you know, what are those things? Tell me in the comment section, then I can do a video about how you can fix them, okay? As you come your way again, don't be a consumer. Come and be a creator. Come and be exactly who God made you to be. Come on YouTube and share from your life, the downs and the ups, and your environment, your skill, your knowledge, and let another person have a breath of fresh air from their part of the world because they met you. Be the global figure that you are created to be. And don't hide, don't hide your talent, your skill, what it is that you can do. Did I mention that YouTube helps you grow? The amount of growth I've experienced in my personal life, in my spiritual life, in my financial life, soon, yes, <laughs> is mind-blowing. I looked at videos I had done in 2017. Of course, I've archived them somewhere. I looked at videos I had done even just a year ago. And the videos I'm doing now and the things I know, and I'm like, no, God. It's a combination of skills. I've learned how to script. I've learned how to make videos, how to use lighting appropriately to get good quality videos. I've learned how to edit. I've learned about um, editing software that I can use. I have learned how to use my phone. Oh my gosh. I hope with a few points of mind, like you say in the debate club, <laughs> they will have been able to convince you that your next step is to start a YouTube channel that can be an empowerment tool for you on all ramifications. Until I come your way again, let me know what are the hindrances to your YouTube career. Things that want to make you don't take this my preaching seriously. <laughs> Guys, let me be serious, but you know what I mean, right? Tell me what it is that is making you feel that you cannot. So I can tackle them in another video and I'll show you what I did. See, it's about getting your mind made up. No obstacle can stop you. If I tell you the things I've been through trying to do YouTube, you'll know that yours is primary school level <laughs> anyway see you in my next video okay